Hi there, welcome again in the series of SSIS course from scratch. In this third video, we are going to see IDE, which is Integrated Development Environment and its features. In our last two video, we have already discussed the introduction on SSIS, ETL and data integration. We also know the advantage and scope of SSIS and we also know what is ETL and how it works. So now we're going to see what is IDE. Here we are going to create our SSIS package and we will perform an ETL step which is extract, transformation and load. In order to understand the steps to set up and install, you can go to my previous video and see how to install IDE and SQL Server data tools on your machine. So let's get started. Right now, this is my IDE and I have already installed this Visual Studio 2012 on my machine. So here you can go to tools select options and in option you can change the color theme from light to dark by default it is light and I have I prefer dark so I have selected dark option here and click OK so right now you can see like the theme is in dark let me show you how it looks like in light view so if I click light and I click OK it's gonna load entire ID in a light mode and here it is so that's about how it's looked like in a light theme I'll change back to dark and it's gonna change the entire visual into dark mode okay so now here you can see we have two options which is start and recent all your recent project will be listed here in the start project we have three options which is new project open and connect to team foundation server we are not connecting team foundation server here we don't have ssis right now but in the new project you can create a new project if you have already a ssis package you can open a ssis package in this and in order to get to this screen this is called start page you can go to view you can click on start page and you can directly land on this page so now in order to create a new project if you click on new project you you can get several options here you can see in business intelligence tree you have three options analysis services integration and reporting services i have a separate course on reporting services which is called ssrs you can go and check that on integration services we can select this option and get started with this project right now i will cancel this and here you can also go with the different tools like connect to a database extensions and import and export settings you have also an option of debugging the script or your package and in teams you can also directly connect to a team foundation server this is the tfs which is which contain your repo and all the changes you have made in your exercise package once you create your first solution if you have any more questions you can directly go to the sample options where it will show you how to create your first solutions if i click this option it will take you to a web page you can see here which is a msdn site and it will explain step by step how to create the ssis package so again this is the solution explorer where you will be listed with all the packages which you have created in your project and for all the news and the latest movement going on in SSIS you can get this from the latest news and get started tab here so this is all about IDE and in our next video we'll gonna create a new project in SSIS which called integration project and we'll take it from there so that's all for this video and I'll see you in the next video till then take care and goodbye